WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We had the Dow Industrials finished down 433. NASDAQ off 188. S&P's down 51. 54, rather. Gold. Gold contract down $15.60, trading at $17.89 an ounce. We have silver off 23 cents, $22.27 an ounce. Light sweet crude. Nice hit on uh, light sweet crude out here. Down 263, trading 68.23. Notes and bonds. The 10 year right now, uh, trading down one at, <coughs> excuse me, folks, at 131.04. 30 years off 22.6 at 161.28. And you have the 10 year uh, right now. Uh, yielding 1.42. King dollar. King dollar down to 52 ticks trade at 96,513. Euro is at 112. Yen is at 113 and a half. And the British pound is at 132 to 1 US dollar. We'll get over and we take a look at the S&Ps, folks. And as I said uh, at the end of the program, I suspect we're going to have a turnaround Tuesday here. Uh, that being said, I'm not looking for anything heavy, but I am looking that we're going to more than likely go higher uh, before we go lower. And we rejected lower price today at 451 on the S&P. You're at 454. I expect you're going to get a bounce. And then the correlation of where we are, meaning vacation, okay, holidays, that bounce, I suspect, will be on lighter volume. And if it is on lighter volume, bottom line, that sets up two different things. Number one, it's going to set up that you're going to be right back down to these lower levels of 448 and the SPY. And then the bigger issue is that if we get over and we take a look at the NDX 100, the three Qs, what you see in the three Qs is this, is that what we actually did out here today is that we broke the swing of 378.90. We went to 377.47. You did reject lower price at that level. You have 58 million shares traded versus the 106. But that being said, you can see that the Qs are actually having a harder time getting away from the low, the swing low. So I suspect you, yes, we will get a bounce. It'll be on light volume. And then watch out, man, because what, you, what we have out here is that that 350 is wide open to get tested. That is the low from October 4th. That's how this th thing seems to be shaken out. And I expect that's more than likely what you get. Because what you're going to see here, folks, is this. Is that as soon as junior, January 1st comes, you got to remember, then you don't pay a tax until the following April. So... You know, that area there, there's going to be a lot of people, it's been a good market, that will wait to January before they sell so the tax bill doesn't go to next year. Have a great one. Have a safe one, folks. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. It kicks us off 9 o'clock in the morning. We'll get them, folks.